So uh, we're in uh, we're in Cyprus, ready for uh, the Welsh match tonight. But uh, you've got an interesting story of, of where you're from and the reason you're here. Well, uh, the reason we're here is because we live in uh, Malta, an another island in the Mediterranean, just as hot. Uh, but we can have some fun and watch the game tonight. The reason specifically we've come here this evening is because it's my wife's birthday. <laughs> and as a birthday treat, I thought a Wales game is nothing better. What's been your favourite campaign moment uh, so far? Belgium home, the crowd. To be the third best side in the world in front of that crowd. But, yeah, it speaks for itself, doesn't it? That Belgium game at uh, Cardiff City Stadium, the atmosphere down there was tremendous. Uh, I'll never forget that singing in the Welsh Arsenal anthem. Standing in the Canton stand in Cardiff on 70 and 88 minutes the last time around with the Belgium game. We just started singing the national anthem and everyone was singing it and it was just just something else. It was so special. I think it it gave the team what it needed because it, you know, 65, 70 minutes in that game, we were sort of <laughs> coming down a bit. But uh, no, I think the fans really really did it justice then to bring us through. It's going to be the Belgium away result, I think, to yeah, get the draw the there, good. really put them out of the picture pretty much. Certainly for winning the group, I think was, was probably the key for me. In terms of the whole feeling, does it feel as though we're on the verge of a historic moment for the, for the Welsh national team? I think we're probably already at an historic moment. I mean, Wales has achieved something right now which it hasn't achieved in the past at all. Uh, I believe we're higher ranked now than uh, that nation next door to us, that small <laughs> one, uh, England. Uh, and that's quite a nice uh, time for us. Yeah, together stronger, as you say. <laughs>